It's uh, story time. I'm going to tell you a little story um, that I think you'll find humorous or interesting. Uh, But first of all, I just want to say thank you for joining me here on my uh, YouTube channel, The Art Project. If you enjoy this video, please hit the like button down below and leave me a comment if you enjoy this story that I'm about to tell you. Um, It happened a long time ago. I'm 46 years old right now, and this happened when I was in high school. My uh, mom uh, hated taking me to school. Um, I went to high school about 20 minutes away from where I lived, and so it was, you know, a 20-minute trip out there and a 20-minute trip back. And so um, every morning I would wake up at the crack of dawn, take a shower, feed myself, get dressed, all that kind of stuff, and be at the door, ready to catch the bus. And if I missed the bus, my mom was so mad. And uh, pretty much every morning, she would holler, Chad, don't miss the bus. She would never get out of the bed to do this. She would just holler down the stairs. And I'm like, Mom, I'm at the door waiting on it. You know, Every now and then, either I was late or the bus didn't show up or something. You know how buses break down and stuff like that. Well, she would have to take me. She hated it. Um, But one day, while I was riding the bus home, um, one of my best friends was riding in his truck behind the bus. And as a um, teenager, um, I was kind of crazy, and I would do really weird stuff. And so uh, I was riding on the very back of the bus, and uh, my best friend, as I was saying, was in the truck behind us, and actually... Um, behind him was another vehicle. So I decided that I would moon my friend from the back of our bus. And uh, for those of y'all that don't know what that means, that means I basically dropped my drawers and showed him my butt, which is a really weird thing in retrospect. I mean, like, why would people do that? Anyway, I did. I stood up on the back of the bus. I um, pulled my pants down showed my butt to my best friend and mooned him and um and then went about my business um the next time the bus stopped the car that was behind my friend pulled up right next to the bus and told the bus driver that a boy in a um, black leather jacket and red and black plaid shirt um had mooned her off the back of the bus he knew exactly who she was talking about and so um he called me up to the front or actually i guess as i was getting off he called me to the front and basically he just shook his head at me and shook his finger at me and said chad don't do stupid stuff like that and so i didn't um later on my mom was always telling me be sure chad that your sins will find you out You will get caught doing whatever. She didn't know anything about this, but she told me over and over and over again, be sure your sins will find you out. All right, skip ahead several years, and I'm in college. And my mom calls me up pretty much every Saturday or Sunday, or I call her, and we're talking. And um, one particular Saturday, she says, Chad, you're never going to believe what I'm doing. And I was like, what? What you doing? And she said, I am testing to get my commercial driver's license so I can drive a school bus. Drive a school bus? You hate getting up in the mornings. Well, anyway, she does. And guess what? She also ends up driving um, a bus back and forth to the school that I went to, to the high school that I went to. And one day, she goes into the teacher's lounge of the... I don't know, wherever the bus drivers hang out at some point, um, the bus lounge, the bus driver's lounge. And she sits down, and there's this man there, and uh, he says hello, and they talk for a little while, and pretty soon he finds out that she is my mother, and she finds out that he was my bus driver. And guess what story he told her? He told her about me mooning my best friend, Chris, off the back of the bus. Um, and so, (laughs) um, sure enough, um, she calls me up later on. This was after she announced that she was going to be a bus driver. Uh, she meets him and, um, obviously, and, uh, she calls me up and she says, Chad, you'll never guess who I met today. I'm like, who? 
She said, Kenny. I said, uh, Kenny? Kenny who? She says, your old bus driver, Kenny. And guess what story he told me? And uh, so there you have it. Be sure your sins will find you out. No matter what you do, uh, you may not get caught right away. Um, but eventually, at some point, you will get caught. Um, this has absolutely nothing to do with these two drawings that I'm doing in my sketchbook. But um, since I'm really just kind of playing around and drawing um, without anything real to say about the drawings, I thought I would share that story with you. Um, so I don't know what kind of moral you can get from that story. Um, but I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, if you got any questions or comments or funny stories you want to leave in the comments down below, that would be awesome. Uh, also, you can check out the links for the um, materials that I'm using. Uh, check out the links in the description below for uh, the materials that I'm using in this video. And uh, give me a thumbs up. Um, subscribe if you haven't already. And uh, share this on uh, your favorite social media platform, Pinterest or uh, MySpace, <laughs> MySpace, that was a long time ago, Tumblr, or wherever you are, um, share it for me, that'll help me out. Um, go make some art. <laughs>